Good morning, America. How y'all are? Happy Monday. We hope you guys are off to a finer than split frog hair kind of day. How you fellas feeling? I feel healthy. I feel happy. I feel terrific. Well, now that we're in the middle of political season, I've never seen the level of hate and vitriol that folks are having towards one another. Everyone now has a platform and a voice on social media, and since you don't have to look people in the eye and can't see the pain and hurt that our words cause, many folks are saying the most vile things about people just because they support a different political candidate or a party than they do. No matter your political beliefs, we should never wish evil upon anyone, and we certainly shouldn't hate someone just because they view the role of government differently than we do. As Christians, Christ has even uh, instructed us exactly how we're to treat those that oppose us. In the Gospel of Matthew, Jesus said that we're to love our enemies, bless those that curse you, do good to those that hate you, and pray for those that spitefully use you and persecute you. I think and most Americans will agree that as a society, we've gotten a bit off track <clears throat> and that we need to come together as one to get the country going back in the right direction. But it seems very few of us are willing to change our own hearts and minds in the process. Mahatma Gandhi said, be the change that you wish to see in the world. We need to be the change that we want to see in the world. Can you imagine just for a moment if that were to take place, what kind of world we could leave our children and grandchildren if we became the change that we want to see in others? Change begins with us. Noah, what would you like to add to the conversation this morning? Set an example. Treat everyone with respect, even those who are rude to you, not because they are nice, but because you are. Woo! Treat them with respect, not because they're nice, but because you are. I love that. Great job. Jonah, what would you like to add to the conversation this morning? Do I not destroy my enemies when I make them my friends? Abraham Lincoln. Woo! Do I not destroy my enemies when I make them my friends? Wow, that is powerful. Luke, what would you like to add to the conversation today? Do right, do your best, treat others as you would like to be treated, Lou Holtz. Woo, that is a great quote by a great, great coach and great motivator, Lou Holtz. Levi, how would you like to round out the conversation today on how we're to treat others? <clears throat> do unto others as you would have them do unto you. Matthew seven twelve. That is exactly right. What is that? The golden rule? That is exactly right. Well, guys, remember, you're meant to be a blessing to others. So we hope you go out this week and bless somebody's socks off. Bye, y'all. Bye.